Hello everyone, I made Friday Night Funkin in Super Smash Bros Ultimate. Here's how. You might be thinking to yourself, how on earth did he turn a fighting game into a rhythm game? Well, mods. In my head, I split this project into three different parts. The custom stage, the custom rule set, and the mods. The first part I started work on was building the custom stage. So, I booted up Smash and went into the stage builder. But there was one big problem. The custom stage builder is extremely difficult to use, and it didn't help that my Joy-Cons were drifting a lot. However, I still managed to make this first prototype. The wind prevents each player from being able to access each other. At the top there's wind going up, and at the bottom there's wind going down, acting as some kind of one-way gate and the platforms below Donkey Kong explode when damaged. Then the cannons shoot him into the blast zone. I added a warp zone that teleports player one into the chamber. You might be thinking, how is this meant to be Friday Night Funkin'? Well, the plan for this stage was for one player to shoot down projectiles to player two, and player two has to body block them to avoid the platform from exploding. Speaking of the projectiles, let's move on to the next part of this project, the custom rule set. Basically, this is what style, format, and items are chosen. Don't worry, I'll come back to improve the custom stage later. I knew that the items would be the most important part of the rule set, because I already knew that I wanted to make it a stock battle and a solo battle, but I had no clue on what items to use, so I knew I had to test them one by one. <sighs> I started by testing the Fire Flower and the Deku Nut. I knew that the Fire Flower fell slowly, so I thought it might have been a good idea. Unfortunately, the Fire Flowers just fell too slowly that they got caught up in the wind. This was really annoying, because if the wind wasn't there, this would have worked. However, the Deku Nut somewhat worked, but it had an extremely low success rate. <laughs> I found even if player 2 did body block it, the ground still exploded. It worked too well. So I decided to test the football, beast ball, pit ball, and the smoke bomb. I immediately found out that the football and the baseball didn't work because you can't pick them up. I found that the pitfall and the smoke bomb together worked almost perfectly. The pitfall doesn't destroy the platform, but if it hits you, it traps you in the ground. The smoke ball destroys the platform, so you want to body block it. Put simply, avoid the pitfall, jump into the smoke ball. Now that I've figured out what rule set to use, I went back to add some finishing touches to the custom stage, because the level had a few big ways to cheese it. If you fast fall, you can go down into the chamber below, but having a bumper there prevents you from being able to fast fall to the bottom. So I added four of them. I added some lava above to give player one a little bit of challenge. In the foreground, over the bumpers, I added some multicolored arrows like in Friday Night Funkin'. This was actually extremely tedious to do, but I'm really happy with the end result. I also made a boyfriend me, just in case the mods didn't work, so I could turn him into a me fighter. Though luckily for me, I didn't have to use this abomination. Now for the biggest part of this project. The mods. If there's anyone at Nintendo watching this, this is all just elaborate Photoshop. I am very good at Photoshop and video editing. Thank you, Nintendo, leave me alone. If you know anything about me, you know that I'm very stupid and don't know how to do anything technical. So obviously, I had no clue on how to mod my Switch. So I forced my dad to do it for me. <laughs> Once I had my Switch ready to mod, I needed to figure out what mods to use. I knew that I'd mainly be using mods that replaced the textures. So I went out into the wild and found some Friday Night Funkin' Smash mods. The first one that I found replaces Ness with the boyfriend. So this mod replaces one of Ness's ults with the boyfriend. And the other mod I installed replaces Mega Man with Tank Man. Although the boyfriend mod is just a recolor, the tank man mod uses a brand new model. The tank man model looks so good, it almost looks official like Nintendo actually added it to the game. He even opens his mouth when damaged. Even the victory screen looks really really cool. 
I also added one final mod that replaces the song Flat Zone 2 with Ur. The only thing left to do now was to play it. So I got my little brother Joe to play it with me. Best out of three. The loser has to eat a super spicy chili. But before we do that, I'd like to ask you, if you've enjoyed this, please hit the like button and the subscribe button. It would help me out a ton and make me happy. Thank you. Hello. Hello. This is Joe. I've made this level, Joe. It's changed a bit since you've last seen it. Okay, so we have to fight it out, Joe. And then if you go into one of the portals, the other player throws down the thing and you just have to survive, basically. You see those portals? You don't want to go into them. Crap, an idiot. Bro, you so... <laughs> oh my god, you... You're comboing me! I know. Uh... Oh, what? Oh, I got a stock, but I... Oh, okay. <laughs> I went into the portal by accident. Yep. Do you see how this works? Oh. Ah, you're in here. How do I kill you without killing you? Oh. Wait, you're not meant to go in yet. <laughs> I'm so good you're... at this. Alright, alright, alright. You're so good, you're so good. You're so good. Yeah, if you're so good, then dodge this. Dodge that. Wait, am I meant to dodge it? No, yeah, you're meant to match out, and you won't be able to get that one. Ah ha ha! Alright, we're doing best out of three. Loser yeah. has to eat, eat a chili. So one one to me, zero to Joe. First to three, first to three wins. A chili? Yes, I'll be Ness this time. Mega Man. It's Tank Man. It's Mega Man. He said it's Mega Man. Do you want to see something funny? Go on. Oh, look, I'm dash dancing. You can't get me. See? See? You're gonna die before. <laughs> you're gonna, di gonna die? No, you're gonna die before you can even throw stuff at me. Okay, okay, okay. Because I'm trying to do it fast. You know what, girl? <laughs> I don't want to eat the chili. I'm stuck in baby jail. That yeah, you hit the bumper, bro. When was the last time you played Smash? Ah! Oh. Ah! <laughs> if you lose this one, you have to eat a chili. I've moved the portals as well to make it even harder. Or make it less fighting, more Friday night fun. Oh, How? Alright, alright, alright. Oh crap. Oh crap. I was taunting. <laughs> Chili. Nope, you're gonna eat a chili right now. I wanna eat a chili. You have to eat a chili. Because I'm better at the game than you. You are so good. I don't wanna eat a chili. Why did you do that? I killed myself. Oh, oh my god. Alright, alright. Found that. No. Ah, ah. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> okay. What? That doesn't count. Frick you. That's what I think. Frick you. <laughs> Oof. What's that? What's that? What's that? What's that? What's that? Uh, you have to eat a chili. You have to eat a chili. Silly Billy. When you jump, eat a chili. Fine. Right, I will eat a chili. Chili. Right. Why? Why am I eating one? <laughs> Get down. I won all the games! I've spent around 40 hours on this video, so if you could hit the subscribe button and like button, it'd make my time worth it and it would make me happy. Thank you. Okay, bye!